Why do some people appear to be defying the aging process? Hi, I'm Shelley Forrester. Welcome to Ageless, the show dedicated to the idea that when it comes to aging, attitude is more important than the number of candles on your cake. My guest today is Stephen Gottlieb. He is an energy healer and empowerment coach. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much for having me. My pleasure. So first thing I'd like to ask you is what's the difference between an energy healer and an empowerment coach? An energy healer is someone who works with a body's natural energy and the energy of the universe, essentially, to help reorganize and repattern the energy in the body so that health is possible, to remove blocks uh, or any impediments to our optimum state of well-being. An energy, an empowerment coach, <laughs> is a term that I basically made up uh, because the more I did intuitive energy healing, the more I found ways of releasing things that were keeping people from being as powered to do the kind of things and they want in life and live the kind of life that they want with joy and with happiness and well-being. Um, so what's the difference between an energy healer mm -hmm. and an intuitive healer? Or are they different? Well, I think that anybody who is a good energy healer is also an intuitive healer. There are many modalities that people can be trained in to be an energy healer. Um, and anybody working with energy will do that. So, for example, an acupuncturist is an energy healer, and in many ways a chiropractor is an energy mm -hmm. healer. But you're seeing more and more energy healing being offered as a modality uh, to help people who are in hospitals, perhaps with cancer patients. So there are very structured courses where people are being taught energy healing techniques, and they get certified to do hands-on energy healing. Mm -hmm.